Mats Madu. We are the children, we are the children, the children of God. Tam Kam Kam. We change our world, we have what it takes to do it smart and make it smart. Welcome to our Smart Do. Hello, my fellow viewers. This is Tad Six. Uh, having a uh, looking at social studies, a very interesting topic on smart edu life known as urbanization in Arusha. Welcome. So, as we start, what we mean by urbanization? I'll always keep reminding you of the meaning of urbanization. Now, this is the growth of towns and the movement of people into the towns, okay? So, that's what we call urbanization. How the towns are still continue to grow and as people continue moving into this town is really crazy. That's what we call urbanization. Okay? Now, as we start, we look at uh, uh, Arusha. Number one, we know that uh, Arusha started first of all as a market center. Okay? A uh, center in the agricultural area between Mount Kilimanjaro and Mount Meru in Tanzania. So actually, it started as a market area due to the produce that people are getting from agriculture from between Mount Kilimanjaro and Mount Meru, that area. The agriculture produce people created a market area known as Arusha Development, developed as a market area for agricultural <coughs> produce. Now, as we start to look at the functions of Arusha, we look at functions. What are the functions of Arusha? So as we start, number one, as we start, functions. One, it's an administrative center. So it's an administrative center. And I'm going to tell you why. Why is it an administrative center? So number one, we need to understand, it's the headquarter of EAC. That's what we call the East African Community. EAC. That's what we call the East African Community. So the headquarters of the offices, they're actually located in Arusha, whereby East African community, that's why we have Kenya, we have Rwanda, we have Uganda, we have Tanzania, okay? So they're able to meet in Arusha, in Tanzania and Arusha, whereby they have their big offices there. The East African community, they have the offices at Arusha. So it became, that's why it's a very important administrative center. Number two, it's a transport and communication center. It's a transport and communication center. So it's a transport and communication center. So it's a transport and communication center. So you find that uh, in this place, they have good roads. So we have a road connecting all the way from Arusha to Nairobi, a very good road. I think if you have ever traveled through that road, very smooth, very straight road connecting Tanzania and Kenya via Arusha to Nairobi. Another one is that it has a railway line, a railway line connecting to Tanga. So all the way from Arusha to Tanga, it's able to connect via railway. It's also served by an international airport known as Kilimanjaro International Airport. So you find that this area is a good transport and communication center within the area. Another one, it's an industrial center. Number three, it's an industrial center. It's an industrial center. Wherever you find a lot of industries are located in this, uh, this area. So we have such as the wood processing, the wood processing. So pro uh, they are able to process wood. We have chemical manufacturing in the area. We have textile industry in the area, and we have a sugar refinery, refining industry. So these are the kind of industries that are located in Arusha. Another one we have is that it's a residential center. It's a residential center, which means a lot of people live around this area. Whenever you find that uh, uh, industries are located in that area, you find that most of the people are able to live in the area. So a lot of people live in this area, making this place a very uh, a good residential area. So thank you so much. I hope you have understood. 
Arusha, so that you're able to go through each one of them as you go one by one. One critical uh, thing I want you to understand is that all the towns are industrial centers. You find that in all the towns, they are industrial centers. It means that all people like living around the towns. So thank you so much for your time. Have a blessed day. God bless.